Hello, thank you for checking out my video today. In today's video, I want to show using stepper motors with my 8088 project over here. As you can see, I've got it on a breadboard. This is just to an 8255 parallel controller. We are in a noisy shop, so you're going to hear some background noises. Uh, we've got a uh, controller board here for the stepper motors. So we're just to the outputs here. We have the direction attached and then the uh, step pin attached, and then the ground tying them together. Over here on the screen, I have my program. Uh, it's, let's get it focused here. It's called T2 for test two, and then it's got three digits. The first digit's the speed, the second digit's the rotation. So there's three motors, so for them to go the same direction, it's either gotta be zero or seven for the same direction, and then the last digit's the number of rotations. So I'm going to come over here and we're going to watch this go. Uh, I'll do one more time, that's blurry. So that's one rotation with the number one in there. So you can see they're going, two are going one way and one's going the other way because that would be one digit lit up for a binary one. So let's make them all go the same direction. So we're going to put a seven in the uh, direction register and that was a five in the speed. And uh, the higher the number, the slower it goes. If we put a letter in there, so this is just out of ASCII, so you just subtract 30. So whatever the ASCII value of the letter is, gets deducted. But the big point here is running machinery with an 8088 is uh, possible. Now, as far as like top speed, there may be some limits. I think we just got the wrong values in there. So our, our program over here, you know, put a space on the number. And so it's going to go for like 256 rotations at a fairly slow rate of speed. We're going to reset the system. So recently I made a breakout board. Um, it's getting made right now for the 8255 uh, parallel controller and it will um, not it'll make this a lot cleaner and not have to breadboard so much. All right, we're booted back up. And we'll do a couple more test runs and then we'll end the video. So that's at speed zero, which is fairly quick. Now the timing on this, I had to put in some delay, but you don't want too much of a delay or too little of a delay, or it, it's not too clean. It's almost like the signal getting to the stepper motors a little off. Got little flags on there so we can see where they start and end. So this is six rotations with a five in there. So the center one would be going a different direction. So anyway, that's kind of a quick demo of a stepper motor with my 8088 project. Thank you for checking out my video.